Du, 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 du. All right, I think we're good. Uh, we're gonna continue. There we go. We're gonna continue from here. The last time we talked to him, we check uh, these things over here, the the things that he's selling and all that. Uh, we found out that the train is not stopping here anymore, so we're gonna continue. Uh, the things that we have on us is the we still have the the winch handle that we need to fix it uh the other the other things behind me is is nothing still editing that's why you left i'm a bit ping a lot and that's that's why i was delayed a little bit on the on the stream uh schedule All trains cancelled it says yeah funny thing though ain't it the trains still keep on zooming by. It makes you wonder what's on board. It's a little bit too loud. Alright, so the train is not working anymore. Uh... Oh, thanks for the bits, Sue. Thanks for the 10 bits. Thank you. Vendom. I don't know if I need to do anything over here. Looks yummy. I tell you, looks can be deceiving, man. The rappers probably got more flavor than the candies themselves. Man, you're not much of a salesman. Hey, we're friends, man. I don't want to rip you off. Besides, you ain't got to worry. I'm not honest when it comes down to real business. <laughs> okay, is it anything else that we need to get? We saw that, we saw that. And more candy. Um uh, It says power core mining breaks new ground. Yeah, that's all over the news too. They make us some crazy discoveries down there in the underlay. Some funky renewable energy source that just keeps going. Man, are we lucky to have brave people like the Amando Mining Company getting their hands dirty down there for our sake. Thank you so for the bits again. What's up, kid? Hey Bona, what's up, man? Alright, let's talk to him again and see if there is anything else. Uh, so how come the train don't stop here no more? Let's let's hear so him again. Don't stop here no more. Something about the Armando Power Company taking over and shutting things down. They own the Armando Railway Authority now too. You heard about that, right? It's all over the newspapers if you're curious. I don't I've, read this drivel I sell though. I've got TV. I've got TV. Alright, I don't see think there is any. I don't Later think there is anything frosty. there is anything over here to do right now. Something with the trucks. I wonder if we can throw something to the trucks. For sh oh wait. No. That could work. But no way I'm standing on the trucks. Ah. Uh, I'm gonna need something with even more force. This steel is tough. Something with a little bit more force. Oh, it makes sense. The train will run on top of this. Maybe I could reach it from below somehow. From below? Okay, maybe from below. How? I don't know. I don't know. I know you. I know you. Don't 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 spam it though. Okay. <laughs> we don't want to annoy anyone. All right, let's go down. Let's go down. Okay. Let's see where we are. We are on the street. Okay. That's the elevator to the railway station. It won't open without an Armando railway card. Oh, fucking hell. Fucking eh. I remember the code. Oh, there we go. So let's go down this time. The Can we go won't down? Go any further. The elevator is not gonna go any further. Why does it? Oh, oh. I was like, why does it allow me to change this? 
Uh oh, I see what's going on. You see the lines? Me clever. Me clever. Genius. Ah, that's it. The plate is all loose now. The plate is all loose. Sabotage rocks, man. Sabotage? What? Oh! Okay, I don't know how I did this. <laughs> Lol. Ha! It's straight as an arrow, man. And we fixed it. There we go. How do we go back now? Up. Nice. We did it. Yeah, I know, I know, I know. Uh, so we need to go to the plane. And put the steering, whatever is that thing. Wait, it's from inside going to the right. Then we put the the anchor over there and we... There we go. We get the anchor. And we are ready to go, there finally. We go. This finally, we are ready to go. Ready to get out of here. That's what I'm talking Good about. Good job, Buona! I just go. got to get these last couple of boats in place, then we are ready to take off. Finally, the edge awaits. The edge? We going over the edge? Awesome! Forget it, lady. That's suicide. They've caught up with us. We need to get airborne now. Relax, lady. Whoever these guys are, they can't just barge Relax. in and... On second thought. Let's get out of here! They are out. Kito, get in here! We're taking off! Hold on, I'm almost done! Oh, it's there working. it is. <laughs> That was close. I'm not sure we shook them. They're chasing us. We got to take off. Here goes. Aha. It must be. Do something, Juana. Go this is so loud. What? Why? Hold on to your legs. We are taking off. We made it! You can stop screaming now. Oh, what Don't the fuck? Don't worry about him. What the There's fuck? A problem with heights, that's all. You're a pilot and you're afraid of heights? No worry, lady. I'm fine with them as long as I don't see them. I'm like, who, who, who is that? <laughs> Let me sit like this for a while and I'll be fine. Tell me if I need to turn or something. I can't believe it. My pilot is afraid of heights. <laughs> I gotta hand it to you guys. You did a good job. What a air! You'll never find a safer way to fly. He's going with the I with his eyes closed. The brim with gas. Of course, lady. Full to the brim with gas. It's, right, Kito? It's the art. Right, Buona. You mean you feel terror, up, right? It's the art I style. Only check for oil. Uh, we might have a problem here. Are you telling me you run a gas station for a living and you forgot to fill the plane with gas before Lord. we took off? Look at the gauge. It's full as bananas. What the oh. hell? What the hell? What are you moron? Oh. You call this safe? We'd be safer flying in a car than Okay, now I can talk. So that was the end of the chapter one? We 
finished the chapter one. That's so cool. You like this game? We have the chapter two and the chapter three. That's two different games. Uh, about the scar, it's just the art style. It's just the way they look. Behind the scenes. Should we? Should we? Should we check? Guys, you don't need to count my viewers every time. Come on. Thank you. Don't, don't. Just don't. Please. Uh, we have the chapter 2 over here. Let's see some behind the scenes. Um, okay, so that's the journey done chapter 1. We're going to go to the chapter 2 in, in a second after we see, you know, some more footage about, you know, what happened. Oh, it was... Okay, I see. It was from from something. Many of the characters are inspired by African masks. Ah. Belongs to the Makonde people who live in Tanzania. Alright, that's, that's cool. That's cool. Amazing game. Interesting puzzle game. I like it. What the banana? I think I froze my game. Give it a little bit. Um. Uh oh. Yeah. Gave me an error. Well, I guess we can go to the chapter 2 now, right? Yeah. Let's go chapter 2. If I open the game and, and I go chapter 2, it's going to take me to the Steam page. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Let's close this. Let's go to the chapter 2. Boom. Nice. And... Where's my Steam? The Junior Man chapter 2. Boom. I have a white screen, give it some time. It starts loud, yeah, yeah. sorry. My screen froze. What happened to the last video? Uh, what video? The behind the scenes? Yeah, it crashed again. Apparently, the game doesn't like the alt tapping. I was trying to balance a little bit the audio and uh, and it crashed. Can I close? There we go. Okay, we closed it. God damn it. Let's give it one, one more try. I know it's gonna be loud. <laughs> Okay, that's a little bit better, isn't it? Well, that happened. That is, that is correct. I click to continue, I have it off. Okay, 
So this is the journey done chapter 2. It's a different game. It's a series of, of the same game. And let's hope this time is gonna be even better. A huge improvement. I don't know. Hopefully the sound is good and it's not too loud again. On the last scene, they flew away. Yeah, it's still a little bit loud. There we go. Report, sailor. Oh, we've caught something in the net, Captain. <laughs> Finally. We might not have to starve to death in this blasted mist after all. All right, let's see what we've caught. Reel it in, Joe! Well, what kind is it? Is it a big one? Can we eat it? It's... it's An airplane. An airplane. <laughs> ah, release the net! Thought we were saved. Scrap salvage is the last thing we need right now. But sir, what if there's food in there? Rations of some sort? Or cake? Maybe it's full of cake. Uh, go ahead. Reel it in and get your cake. I don't care. Oh, so they... Oh, okay. They got Ouch! the plane in a... I told you it was a bad idea to have a farm of cacti in an airplane. <laughs> Don't this my cacti, man? It's not their fault that you landed on them. Well, maybe if you hadn't crashed the airplane, I might have considered not sitting on one. <laughs> oh, yeah, great landing, Buona. I'm glad you're still alive, so I still have the chance to strangle you! Master Pilot, huh? Uh, enter? Hello! Got any food? <laughs> I will ask, I will answer your question in a second when they So let me get this straight. Dialogue's We're simply finished. stuck out here in the mist? I'm afraid so, miss. This ship isn't going anywhere. Without a lighthouse to guide us, we have no idea where to steer. We're just gonna have to wait it out. If you're lucky, it won't be more than a couple of weeks. I can't believe this. Is there really nothing we can do? Well, if we knew our bearings, I guess that'd be a good start. But we don't. We've always relied on the lighthouse for navigation. So they are, Buona, they are stuck on the pilot. sheet. You have any ideas? What you need, lady? Our bearings. We need to find out in which direction the ship is heading. Ah, no worries, Lena. You can always count on. Yeah, how, how I'm gonna find Great. out. I'll take this opportunity to catch up on some more reading. Hmm, how the heck am I gonna figure out what direction the ship's going? Smell the wind. Smile to the sky. Uh, see, see the moon? Huh? Maybe? Okay, so it's a click time. Alright, so we flew. We ran out of gasoline. We fall into the ship and we are here and the story continues. If you have any questions, let me know, okay? Uh, what do we do in sign? Pico. It says Pico. I guess that's the name of the ship we're on. I guess. Let me put a little bit volume. There we go. Uh, cabin. Is it anything else? Joe. Let's hey, talk Joe, to him. What you looking for? I'm trying to catch a glimpse of Port R2. Or another vessel. Or anything that might help us get back to port. But all I see is darkness. He sees it's darkness. That bad buoy, of course. <sighs> We're gonna stay moored to it until the fog lifts. So Outless we don't space or sky? Away. No, could no, no. Today, could be in a week. They fall down to the ocean. And this is a this is a ship. Like they fall down. As far as I know. What is this place? You're on board the MS Beacon. An eel trawler lost somewhere in the thick soup and mist far from its port. Do you think so? They're in the water, right? 
So this boat catches eels. So this boat catches eels? Yeah. Sure. It's the only thing we misters can do. Hunt for eels. Ain't nothing else out to miss as far as I know. Only darkness. Cold, wet darkness. darkness. Problem now is we can't catch Jack in this thick mist. No eels get stuck in a static net. And we don't dare move in case we drift further away. Something that kind of bothers me about this game, and, and, and I think it's the only thing that bothers me, is the fact that I don't have the... Uh, I. I can't balance the voice volume with the sound effects. That's the only thing that bothers me, because I want the voice a little bit louder uh, and a little bit lower the effects around, you know? All right, can, can I, I help? help? Well, your lady friend was onto something there. If we somehow can figure out our bearings, we might just have a chance of getting out of this suit on our own. What is the mist anyways? I have no idea. It's just, it's just there. Is there no water <laughs> what is the down mist? there? I can't hear any waves. Nobody knows what's down there. We're not supposed to ask. If you start asking those kind of questions in the port, you'll get busted in no time. We don't talk about it. The boats just kind of float. And that's all we need to know to catch our eels. Okay. Catch you later, Joe. Okay. Keep wanna stay afloat. How yes, you feeling, lady? Oh, I'm doing my best to distract the seasickness with this book of yours, and it's actually working. Your okay, father, Captain Dodo, was onto something big with this. This book really is an amazing find, and I'm sure we'll be able to reach the Underland with this. I just know it. We need to figure out its meaning before it's too late. Yeah, they want to go to the Underland. Re reaching the Underland? Reaching the Underland? Shh, Buona, stop talking so loud about it. Yes, of course we're trying to reach the Underland. That's why we need this book. Something real crooked is going on down there, and I'm hell bent on finding out what it is. Hmm. I don't Too know. Late for what? Listen, Buona. The thugs who broke into the university and chased us from the charter are dead serious on covering their tracks. We must get into port and find some answers before they silence every last lead to their dirty operation. Hello, Crack. Welcome to the stream, bro. I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. How about you? I'm doing some story mode with blue. Ah, there's wires over here. What's going on with you? Hmm. What's this? Ouch! <laughs> Those wires are dangerous. Did we destroy something over here? Ah, we don't have anything anything on, on our inventory. So we need to repair this for some reason to open the door, probably. No? Okay, we can go in. There's a button. It doesn't seem to be working. Just eating some breakfast, chilling. Welcome to the party. Everyone is chilling over here. What did he say? It's still not working. Still not working is the thing outside that we said, the wires. Very interesting game here. Yeah, it's, it's a very nice. Hello, Mihaly. Welcome back to the scene, bro. It's my, it's my friend, Mike. Um, okay, we're gonna we're gonna go up and see what's going on over here. Oh, there's a key. It's locked. It's locked. Hey, there's a key inside. Who's that? Captain. Hello, Captain. Hello. It's no use. He's fast asleep. Hello. Okay, it's he's no not gonna wake up. What do I do? Hmm. The window is fastened with two screws. With two screws? Hmm. The window is fastened with two screws. Eh, uh, my friend, with the angle that you give me, you don't give me much to do. Can't reach it. I know you cannot reach it. It's locked. Where is the holes? I don't see them. Porthole, porthole. Well, I see an arrow there. I guess this takes me... This takes me down. Okay. It's 30. Uh, what is 30? Hmm. The 
window is fastened with two screws. Yeah, I see. Okay. You cannot open. You can talk. To okay. Is it anything, anything else we need to go? Nice steering wheel. Yes. There's a drawer there that I cannot touch. Can I... Can I walk? I cannot walk. Alright, we cannot do anything. Maybe it's something down there that I don't know. Maybe to my ship. There we go. There we go. Kito, brother. How you doing, man? I'm okay, Buana. Just a little seasick. <laughs> seasick. I think I'm gonna lie here for a while. Of course, man. I've got this covered. There we go. We're gonna take the screw and hey, we're gonna go can back. Can I borrow that screwdriver? <laughs> sure, man. Knock yourself out. Thanks, buddy. No Thanks, problem, buddy. Buana. Go drive them screws. Yep, we found the screw. There is a tape here. I guess we won't need our makeshift safety belts anymore. But the duct tape might still come in handy. Alright, we have a duct tape. Let's see what else we can find from here. Uh, compass. Okay, compass. The compass is still intact. Maybe I can detach it from the instrument panel somehow. Uh, do you need this? Perfect. This is probably exactly what Joe needs. Hey, Let's go. Anna, I thought tinkering with yeah, the sure, was What's my up? job. No, no. Your job is fixing the airplane after I break it. <laughs> <laughs> fixing the airplane after you break it. Sounds like a sounds like a plan. Okay. So now we can go inside. Very nice. Uh there is wire. Should I duct tape the wires? I don't think that's gonna help. Okay. <laughs> First class engineering. First class engineer. He didn't want to watch this, so it went. It sent me to another stream. What the heck? Ah, maybe you swapped. If you swap, it goes to a, to a, to another stream. That's funny. Light. There, there we go. Beautiful light. Kip and Slash the wires said we have to conserve energy, but he's taking it too far. Oh, this darkness is horrible. I'm just thinking about all those scary things out in the mist is driving me mad. What Aww. scary things? Pirates. Bloodthirsty pirates. Pirates? Not to mention the eels. Small ones are friendly enough, but the big ones. Oh, the big ones. I don't want to think about it. Wish we were back in Port Archie. Big ones. Okay. There are pirates out there? You're kidding me. You never heard of the Sisulus? Nastiest pirates there are. They're a curse to these mists and to all of us who work it. They heck and slash their way through any vessel they encounter. No matter the flag. Oh, it's a bloody mess when they're done. Stay clear of the Sisulus if you want to keep your body parts. That's all you, I'm saying. Do you mate. think we're gonna encounter bloodthirsty yeah, pirates? Eaten by eels? Really? Really? You never heard about the Hungries? I've heard tales of them swallowing entire ships Hungries. twice the size of this one. You mean a what giant eel could pop up and eat us at any minute now? Well, as long as there's a charge left in our batteries, we should be okay. Legend Jesus. has it they never come close when you got your lights on. It's what happens when we run out of fuel and everything goes dark that scares me. As, as small as you are on the stream, I'm looking at... LOL. <laughs> Tell me about Port Archu. It's the only town down here on St. Armando. As far as I know, at least. It's the home port of most ships working the mist. Sometimes the fog lifts, but... Most of the time, it's just completely enveloped in a thick, soupy fog. It's no happy place, but it's certainly better than being stuck out here. There's warmth there. <gasps> and food! Wonderful food! Oh, crocky, mate. Oh, it's cracking stuff. Okay, imagine going to another streamer and thinking that is me for some reason, because he looks kind of like me, spending hours upon hours talking to him, and then you realize, oh, shit. That's not blue. <laughs> See you around. 
All right, let's see what's what's around. I see the spring over hey, there. Hey, look, a loose I spring. Had my, I had my eyes on you. I'd better take it before it pokes someone's eye out. Yeah, be, of course, before someone... Okay. Button... Oh, sink. There's a sink over here. It's just a sink. I don't really have any use for it. All right, so you... you will, Buana. The water coming out of that tap is just about the only thing left to drink on board this ship. Hmm. We had a couple of bottles of eel rinse too, but I'm pretty sure the captain has finished them all by now. Eel rinse? What's that? It's nasty stuff. Nasty industrial grade stuff. You're not supposed to drink it really, but everybody does. Okay. So you are asking him a bunch of que questions about this game. Do you want to ask me? <laughs> I don't think anyone has your accent blue. Yeah, I, I guess. So this 